Why do I look so good after my workout? Why do I look so good after my workout? Enough of chicken talk. A little bit indecisive. Hello loves. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Welcome or welcome back. Oh yeah, that makes sense. I thought I said welcome or welcome. But I said welcome or welcome back. I said it right. Anyway. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Ah. I am in my workout onesie. You can't see it, but I'm not gonna lower it for y'all to see everything. But I just got done working out. I did a whole hour of Zumba. But it's not like 100% like hit cardio. It's like five minutes of warm up. Those next two workouts are like kind of warm work up, warm ups, like stretch exercises. And like the next five six videos are like good exercise cardio, you know, ones. And then like the last two are cool down ones. But hour of that because I'm in my winter arc. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if you ever heard of it. It's just like the last two, three months you take um, your like exercise, health, everything serious. You hit it hard the last, for me, it'd be the last two months because October is already over, literally. The last two months are very serious on my health and exercise. And it's kind of just a prep for January. When everyone's starting in January, you've already accomplished what you want it because you're in your winter arc this is the first time i don't know about y'all that i've ever heard that expression i did not know what a winter arc was i've seen like four or five six videos on it though and a lot of people are getting on it and i don't want to be left behind i got fomo bad fomo bad october 29th and it's 8 29 28 october 29 8 28 p.m we started at like 7 10 7 15 so we've been working out for like more than an hour. And we do Zumba, by the way. Me and my mom. Me and Mumsy, we're both doing it hard. Like, literally. We said January, we're both going to lose 20 pounds or 30 pounds. I hope to God that's true. But I love documenting it with you guys. I usually don't go more past more than like two weeks. But we're going to get past that. We're going to do two months. Very excited. As you can see. Why do I look so good after my workout? Why do I look so good after my workout? And when I took professional headshot photos this morning, I looked like trash. Somebody tell me. <laughs> anyway, if y'all aren't on y'all winter arc, prepare. Get on it now. Get on it with me, bestie. But it's not just about exercising and eating right, you guys. That's not what just makes a winter arc. It's also about your mental. I want to be journaling. I want to be read it, writing in my diary. I want to be self-reflecting, manifesting, but not in a bad way. Like, I'm a Christian, so they really say you can't be manifesting. But I want to be, like, manifesting things for myself that the Lord will allow me to do and guide me and lead me in his, his vision. Because I don't want to do anything that's not in his. And I don't want to jump the gun on anything. Because if you're doing something that's not, of like, of him... It's not going to work. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. Been there, done that, tried that. If it's not his vision, if it's not his way, there's always... I don't even want to get in that with you guys. But just know, when I say manifest, I'm not manifesting to, like, the universe. Um, I say manifest as, like, things that I want to see for myself. But whatever the Lord will allow or whatever the Lord leads me. Of course, I can't just say, Lord, I want this. Lord, I want that. Lord, I want whatever. And I don't even try or put myself in situations where I could get that. We have to show effort as well. Ask for things, go for it, and if I get it, it was meant for me. And if it wasn't, something's better for me. There's something out there that's better for me then. I'm tired of being in a slump. I'm tired of being in negative headspace, being sad, being in not my depressive area because I was never depressed. Definitely like not in a good headspace these like last two months, like this last yeah, I would say two months ago, I was, like, not in a good headspace. I'm just so over that. I want to get out of that. I want to be my fittest. I want to look the best. I want to be achieving goal after goal after goal after goal. And you have to 
make them like I've made goals for the beginning of this year but am I revisiting those goals every single month and then the week and then the like monthly goals am I revisiting those every single week and I'm surprised we're surprised we're not making them so yes winter arc is here I gotta take off my lashes y'all wanna take them off with me these are not my real lashes I hate recording with the air on so boy babes I'll see you tomorrow oh wait I gotta do the other lash see the difference though ow, ow. gotta be careful cause sometimes you pull out a real one <laughs> I always start back here and then I think if I go to towards y'all like y'all will hear me better but the mic is right here oh and uh for future I do apologize for the audio of the last three videos I was in Texas it's not like I didn't have my mic because y'all saw me pack my mic in my Florida Texas vlog <laughs> I just never took it out and y'all saw me pack my laptop and I never took it out and you saw me pack my book atomic havocs and i never took it out <laughs> but i feel like i need them and in the moment when i pack them i feel like i'm gonna work and i feel like i'm gonna read okay anyway i really do i can't i can't with the air it's just so damn loud bye I'm done working out, day two. I need to show y'all what I eat. Today I ate, like I drank my morning coffee and I was like, oh, I'm not gonna be drinking coffee. No more coffee, no more coffee vibes. Yeah, I don't do that anymore. Or it's starting tomorrow, I won't. <laughs> A little bit. Don't get too close. Nice. Everyone, it is 7.30. Ready to walk. It's quite humid out. Let me see if I can put you down for a second.
started to sprinkle and my hair is getting all frizzy. Hello, you guys. Why does my hair look like that? Zumba, I'm literally doing it every other day. Yesterday, did I do it? That's good. Oh, yesterday I did two workout, by the way. I did a walk in the morning, like 2.6 something miles. I will show you guys. I didn't get to show y'all yesterday. And then I did, I did do Zumba then, because I remember I did two workouts. Very good on my workout. Very good on my water intake. Honestly, everything's looking good except except the most important which is our diet five out of ten i'm eating a lot of bad things right now yeah this is the critical time for me this is when i quit my diets the most this is when i'm just like fuck it i can do what i want i give myself a green pass for when i'm on my period <laughs> but it's not okay like we put these restrictions on us for the next two months obviously i'm gonna have two periods then you have to push forward pretty sure like two days ago i drank like a little coke um, and then this morning, I haven't eaten anything, but I was like, I saw some chocolate in the fridge. I was like, I need this chocolate. <laughs> I haven't been getting any coffee. Even though this morning when I took my cousin to school, I wanted to go get a coffee so bad. But I didn't bring my wallet, so I couldn't buy one. That's my update, you guys. Hello, you guys. Real update. I look really, really bad, so don't look at me. But I just wanted to tell y'all that... I went out with my friends, and I made really, really bad decisions. <laughs> well, it happened before. It was like the whole day. The whole freaking pizza. Not a whole pizza, but like half a pizza. And then I get, I drink a, a water at the restaurant. But I got a restaurant, and then I got kisses. Yes, I ate half of them because I was literally so full, full, so full from the pizza that I already ate. And I had gotten like a drink, like a sugar-free Red Bull vodka. Only had one though because I'm driving and I have to be responsible and I really don't get drunk anymore because I don't do alcohol anymore. Except for on a special occasion I had one, but other than that I, I don't do alcohol anymore. That happened yesterday, but today we're working out and we're eating good. So, really quick I want to show y'all. This is my breakfast. Now this is like a all mini, I don't even know, it's like the Frosted Flakes, but... This is good too. Oh yeah, that's good. And I put in some honey. So this is what I'm eating for breakfast. just updating you guys today is a new day or hello hello is a brand new day what's today it's november the 12th it's 12 already oh my god yeah it's 12 56 which is basically one but i told myself i wasn't allowed to eat till 12 today for fasting purposes but i made do not be alarmed this is not coffee <laughs> is a banana, lots of ice, an egg, like two or three tablespoons of oats. Um, oh, one tablespoon of cocoa natural unsweetened powder. And yeah, that's basically what it is. It's like a chocolate banana smoothie. Chocolate banana frappe without the creamer. Without sugar. I did put natural sugar, like honey, a little bit of honey in there. And then this is caramel. 
I wanted it to look like an iced coffee. Sorry about that, you guys, but I had to go because I heard my chickens. They're making a big rumble. Don't ever have chickens. Right now, my dad incubated a couple the last couple months or whatever, but they're the biggest pain in my ass. There's too many boys. There relatively should only be about one or two boys. There's like six or seven boys, and they're like bullying the girls. So there'll be like four boys chasing around one girl. So I go out there, I tire them bitches out. I throw my chanclas at them. I start like separating them. They're just a bunch of like the dudes. I hate them. I already told my dad this weekend he needs to, some of them. We're not even eating their eggs anymore. But enough of chicken talk. This is a little bit of caramel. I just, I did put a little bit of caramel because this is like, I would, my used to coffees, I would put a lot of caramel. But I did put a little bit to um, make it look pretty. It went down all the way to the bottom. And then I put a little bit of whipped cream too. I think it looks like a coffee. But like I said, it's really like a banana, chocolate, oats, smoothie type thing. It's really freaking good. More breakfast. Because this is just my drink, y'all. Looking at the protein shakes, but I think I might get something completely different. I think, oh, this is kind of cute. A little bit indecisive. $19, by the way. I think I might get this to put in my chocolate banana shakes in the morning. Hmm. These are quite cute, too. I like the clear ones. It's workout time. This is my little workout onesie. I didn't go to big yet. I'm gonna change real quick. I don't know about y'all, but I feel really profesh. I think these are specifically for the people who do like um like biking. Ready to do this, you guys. Ready, 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 ready. My pre-workout was sugar-free Red Bull. Continuation, continuation. Hey guys, update. I am very sweaty. And no belt. But I'm 
so sweaty. I can feel the sweat on my back. Grow with y'all, don't play.